Somewhere in the canals of Mexico City, there lives a creature that refuses to die. Cut off its leg, it grows another. Crush its heart, it beats again. Destroy part of its brain and it heals itself. It's not science fiction, it's the axolotl, nature's own wolverine. But here's the twist. This immortal creature that could revolutionize medicine is quietly disappearing from Earth. Part 1. The Immortal Salamander Axolotls are native to just one place on Earth. The ancient lakes beneath Mexico City. Locals once called them the spirits of water, but scientists call them biological gold because they don't just heal, they rebuild. Lose a leg? It returns perfectly. Bones, nerves, skin, and all in just 30 days. Cut their spinal cord? They'll swim again. Even after removing 20% of their brain, they recover with no memory loss. That's not resilience, that's rebirth. How? Their body contains a unique genetic reset button. When injured, their cells de-differentiate, turning back into stem cells, like pressing control pluses on evolution. Here's the shocker. Humans share 90% of the same DNA. But for some reason, our regeneration switch is turned off. And scientists think, if we can find that missing switch, we could rewrite human biology itself. But this miracle of nature is dying in silence. In the wild, less than 1,000 axolotls remain. Just 30 years ago, the same canals held over 6,000 per square kilometer. Today, some researchers searched for months and found one. Mexico City's expansion drained their ancient lakes. Pollution, invasive fish, and climate change did the rest. Ironically, their only safe home now is inside research labs. But this raises a terrifying question. If all wild axolotls vanish, we lose genetic diversity, the secret ingredient scientists need to decode regeneration. Without the wild ones, the lab ones become clones. And clones can't save humanity forever. Right now, in secret labs across Japan, Germany, and the US, scientists are doing something shocking. They're injecting axolotl genes into mice, and those mice are healing like axolotls. Burned skin regrowing, nerves reconnecting, spinal injuries reversing. One experiment even helped rats regrow muscle tissue after amputation. Imagine a world where amputees regrow limbs, burn victims, heal without scars, and Alzheimer's patients repair their damaged neurons. This isn't fantasy anymore. It's biology, waiting to be unlocked. But every day, as Mexico's canals dry up, that hope slips closer to extinction. Part 4. The Human Connection The real villain isn't nature. It's us. We built over their home, poisoned their lakes, and then studied their corpses for answers. Yet, hope remains. In Xochimilco, local farmers are now rebuilding axolotl sanctuaries inside their traditional chinampa farms. These floating gardens filter water naturally and give the axolotls their home back. In just one year, populations rose by 35%. For the first time in decades, life is returning to the canals. So maybe the axolotl's biggest power isn't regeneration, it's forgiveness. If your mind just exploded learning about Earth's real-life wolverine, Hit that like button and subscribe for more weird science that will blow your mind every week. And tell me in the comments, if you could regenerate one body part, which would it be? Let's help these tiny heroes before their story ends. Because sometimes, the cure for humanity comes in the smallest package.